Oh, I didn't know he passed away. First, uh, let me send my condolences. Wow, to pro brass angler uh, Aaron Martins. Um, he died after his, uh, you know, after he was dealing with cancer. I know he was battling cancer. And for those of y'all who like to watch um, pro bass and uh, uh, you know, fishing on Sunday, he was, man, he was, he was, he was a guy. Wow. Anyway, uh, my my condolences to his family and his friends. Now on to this story. Um, this guy, Henry Ruggs. Did you guys know that this guy, he was hit with five charges over the fatal crash that he did that killed a woman and her dog. Today they was riding in the car. Um, and this guy troubles to get drunk and get his ignorant self behind the wheel of a car. Um, with all the warning, with all the information out there about drunk driving, with all the people who have that had their lives damaged by drunk driving, these people still want to jump their asses in the car and drunk drive. And in this case, he's done because he actually murdered someone. He actually murdered someone. Now that is a problem. My God. He's now facing a total of five charges stemming from his fatal car crash this week, including four felonies. Court records show that the former Las Vegas Raiders star has been hit with DUI resulting in death. DUI resulted in substantial bodily harm, presumably those are for the injuries that were caused to his girlfriend. She was the passenger in the car. And two reckless driving charges, all felonies. Ruggs was also hit Friday with the misdemeanor charge of possessing a gun under the influence of alcohol. If convicted on all counts, prosecutors say Ruggs is facing up to 46 years behind bars. As we previously reported, Ruggs is accused of speeding his Corvette while drunk on Tuesday morning in Las Vegas, all while carrying a loaded gun. And they said this guy was traveling upwards 156 miles an hour. He slammed into the back of a Toyota at 127 miles an hour, killing the woman and her dog, and her car just burst into flames. She incinerated. In the video obtained by TMZ, they have the moments of the crash. And Ruggs was uh, swearing and sobbing just a few uh, feet away from the wreckage. Uh, he ultimately showed up in court Wednesday with a neck brace and a wheelchair, though he did not enter a plea. The 22-year-old, oh my God, is due back in court next week for another year. He's only 22. His girlfriend is down there on the ground telling the people to tend to him and help him and uh, this, that, and the other. And, you know, no disrespect, but, I mean, I'm like, yeah, yeah. As they're sitting here, they kind of know what's going on after they're assessing and evaluating the scene. Because all this stuff is under is is on a surveillance camera, cameras all up and down the roads everywhere. Their 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 grief is is incomprehensible to lose your loved one that way. Some damn drunk driver come down and smash the damn drunk driver, drunk drive an uh, innocent person in the car with their dog. And you kill them both. And um, and now you're going to have to um, 
you're going to have to pay the cost for that, bro. There's just no way around that. That was totally irresponsible. Totally irresponsible. I don't know. What y'all think? You think I'm overreacting? I don't know. I'd like to hear what you think. Tell me. Please. And I'll see you in the next video.